Well, this is the time of year to get your lawn ready for spring, but many lawns across Metro Vancouver are being destroyed by a nasty little creature. The European chafer beetle is showing up in more and more neighborhoods. CTV's Peter Granger now on what's causing the spread and what can be done to stop it. They're all through here. They're going to be everywhere in here. They're everywhere, right? They're everywhere. They're everywhere. They are the grubs of the European chafer beetle. What do you know? More chafer grubs. <laughs> <laughs> the invasive species first showed up in New Westminster in 2001 in a tainted shipment of soil. Since then, they've infested almost every municipality in Metro Vancouver. This is the jumbo prawn dinner for a raccoon at the uh, midnight smorgasbord, right? So they... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> and, the, and the turf comes up easy because the, uh, you know, the chafers have been feeding on the root system. Weakened lawns make it easy for predators to plow the sod in search of a quick meal. <coughs> Crows do a lot of damage, but skunks and raccoons really tear it up, like this guy who destroyed this lawn within a couple of hours. It's everywhere, but uh, it's particularly bad on the west side of Vancouver right now. And is it worse this year? Yeah, definitely worse this year. I'm not sure if it's due to the incredibly mild winter that we had, but uh, yeah, we've noticed a lot more damage. There are things you can do to discourage the turf turners. You can put plastic webbing out on your lawn or dangle old CDs from trees. It scares crows. As well, some people put hot sauce into a gallon of water with a little bit of detergent, spread that out over the lawn. Some people swear by it. The better option is to interrupt the life cycle of the chafers, like what the Hindmarch family did. Neighbors are green with envy. For $100, they had their turf treated using a low-toxicity pesticide. Next door didn't. I'm doing it this year again, no question about it. Yeah. Well, I see what the people that haven't done it have all the trouble they go to. The other less effective option is to spray your lawn in midsummer with nematoids, microscopic worms that attack chafer eggs. And you can always try praying. Peter Granger, CTV News, Vancouver. You know, it's not the crow's fault or the... A lot of people blame the crows. You're just looking for a little meal. Right? Nasty, Nasty little, little guys. Snack. Man, some brutal-looking lawns oh, out there. Oh, boy, oh, boy.